Hey guys, we're going to be working on your words for Westlandia. I wanted to let you know that some words do not follow the English phonics rules because of their word origin. Origin means where it comes from. So a lot of your words in this list come from other places like Hawaii, Spanish words, um, Poland, Australia, and also some American Spanish words. So, like I said, some, some of these words are not going to follow the rules exactly how we've been learning them, but know that it's because of their word origin. So, the first word's going to be khaki. Khaki, sound it out. K, a, k, e. The first sound is it's spelled with a K-H, and that's because of the word origin. A, K, E. E at the end of the word is spelled with an I. And this word is from Persia. So it's Persian origin. K, and this says E, ka, ki. The next word is from Hawaii. So it's Hawaiian origin. The word is hula. Sound it out. H -u -l -a. H -u. And Hawaiian, uh, the vowels always say the same thing. And the U says U. Who, uh, uh. It's a uh because it's unstressed in the unstressed syllable. So it says uh. The next word has a Spanish origin. It's banana. Sounded out. B, uh, n, a, n, a. Uh. B. For those of you who are still having problems with B and D, B, B, my lips are closed, the line comes first. B, A, N, A, N, A. These two say A uh because they are in the unstressed syllable. This is the schwa, the upside down U, I mean the upside down E. Let me fix that. Upside down E is the schwa. The schwa says uh. This is the stressed syllable, and so it says it's a. Ah, it's short sound. B, na, na. The next one is a French origin. French origin. It's ballet. Sound it out. B, a, l, a. B. The line comes first and then the bubble. A, L, A. E, T says the A, long A sound because it comes from French and that's how they do it, ballet. Now, this needs to be doubled because this needs to be a short vowel. Remember, if ba is the first syllable, Lay is the second. So if we cover up the lay part, that's an open syllable. The open syllable, the vowel is long. Well, a is the short sound, so we need to protect that short vowel. So we double the middle consonant. The syllable break is there. So now we have a closed syllable. The vowel is short. Ballet. The next word is German origin. Waltz. Waltz. Sound it out. W -a -l -t -z. W -a -a. Now let me let you know what well, the next sound is. Ul. An A followed by an L or even a silent L says the A sound. W -a. So it's spelled with an A. But it says ah, like a A W or short O ah. 
sound. Okay. Ah. O. T. Z. Waltz. The next word is Spanish origin. It's tomato. Sound it out. T. A. M. A. T. O. The first sound is T. A. Uh, that's the unstressed syllable. It's spelled with O. M. A. T. O. Tomato. Syllable break. T. Me. To. This is an open syllable, but it's unstressed, so it's going to say the uh sound. May is actually the stressed syllable, so it's going to be the long sound to open syllable. And to, or sometimes tomato, sometimes we say uh, so it could be the schwa sound uh, or it could be the long o for the open syllable type, tomato. The next word is vanilla. I'm going to scoot my words over a little bit. Spanish origin. Let me go ahead and move this up. All right, Spanish vanilla. Sound it out. V a m i l a vanilla. V a, uh, it's a schwa, it's spelled with an A in this word. M, I, O, A is the schwa. V, N, L, V, N. Now, L is the last syllable, but this is short, so this needs to be a closed syllable. So we need to double the L. Syllable break is between the L's, but it goes in one box because it makes one sound. V, nil, la. And we'll do one more word before we break and do the second video with the second half of the words. This next word is American Spanish. In other words, it it's a, a Spanish word from the Americas. The word is canyon. Canyon sounded out. K a n y a n. K a n y a is the schwa. Let's spell with the o in this word. N. Canyon. All right, let's pause it there and then we'll come back to the list in just a second.